Hey guys, it's your boy C's. And while the studio is being renewed and I don't have the green screen, I thought it would be cool to introduce myself and intro to the next video. So this is my room. I also work at a print shop. As you can see, some of my favorite things are here around us. So today we're diving into the world of hybrid cars. HEVs or hybrid electric vehicles have been around for some time now and they are not only not going anywhere, but by the looks of things, they're probably what's going to win out in the end, in my opinion. With ICE cars getting more and more controlled or scoffed at by governments, not the people. EVs just not there yet with the infrastructure and sustainability and hydrogen also not being so feasible, hybrid systems are doing pretty good. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the show. Help me grow this channel and leave a comment letting me know what's the next thing you want to see. I'll make it happen. Let's get into it. Introducing the Toyota Hybrid System 2 a cutting-edge technology that combines a gasoline engine with an electric motor to provide unparalleled fuel efficiency and reduced emissions. I'm going to refer to this as the THS for the rest of the video. Toyota is leading the way and has been for some time with hybrid vehicles. The THS consists of an engine, power control unit, battery, motor, and generator, and a power split device. When the vehicle is stationary, the system will automatically switch off the engine and rely on the electric motor to power essential functions such as AC and lights. Upon starting up, the system seamlessly transitions from electric power to the combustion engine, providing a smooth and efficient driving experience. The system works by using the electric motor to assist the gasoline engine during acceleration, allowing the vehicle to operate more efficiently by reducing the load on the engine. The electric motor also acts as a generator, capturing energy during braking and deceleration to recharge the vehicle's battery, which converts kinetic energy into electricity that can be stored in the battery for later use. At lower speeds or when starting from a stop, the electric motor provides initial power to get the vehicle moving. As the vehicle accelerates, the gasoline engine kicks in to provide additional power. The electric motor assists the engine during acceleration, providing extra torque and power when needed. This combination of the engine and the electric motor working together is known as power assist mode. At cruising speeds, the gas engine is primarily responsible for providing power to propel the vehicle forward. The electric motor may assist the engine to maintain a constant speed or to provide additional power when needed. The system continuously monitors driving conditions such as speed, load, and battery charge level to adjust the power distribution between the gas engine and the electric motor. The regenerative braking system continues to capture energy during coasting and deceleration, which is then used to recharge the vehicle's battery. This helps to maintain the battery charge level and optimize the efficiency of the system. Don't forget to give us a like and a subscribe as it is the best way to help out our growing channel so I can make bigger, better, and more interesting videos for you.